Hey what's up guys, Dromodi back with another exciting first tutorial and today we are going to convert a simple image into something looking like sketch. So let's get started. So first of all go to file and open the image you want to convert into sketch. Now double click on your layer and hit ok. Now press ctrl J to duplicate your layer and now press Control shift u it will turn your image into a black and white you can do it manually also image adjustment and black and white now again duplicate your black and white layer and press Control i it will invert all the color value of your image now go to your blending option and select color dodge at this point your image should look white sometimes it will have some dots but don't worry about that it will look almost white so now go to filter blur and Gaussian blur and our sketch is ready seriously it's done now hit ok it is looking like sketch right but not really good sketch I mean it's not looking like it's on paper so I'm going to apply a paper texture on my image for that press Ctrl Alt Shift and E. It will create a composite snapshot of your image. Now select and rename it Sketch SKTCH. Uh, now select all your bottom layers and press Ctrl G. It will put them into a group. Now create a blank layer between your sketch layer and your group layer. Now go to file and select place and place this texture paper texture I have provided link in the description for the download it's totally free so place your texture here and enter now for a moment shut off your sketch layer and I, we don't know this layer one actually shut it off now press ctrl T and fill your background with this layer now turn your turn on your sketch layer and put it on multiply much better right but texture is kind of too much saturated and dark so I'm going to image adjustment and oh wait first of all we we'll have to rasterize this layer now we can apply an image adjustment so image adjustment and hue saturation and we will turn down saturation a bit okay now again go to image adjustment and levels and I'm going to enlighten some mid tones and also some highlights just don't believe in these numbers your if your paper texture is different it will work differently and every image has different color values so play with the sliders until you are happy and press ok now this is looking much better than we had something previously right now also let's try some new textures I mean go to file plus and here we have some lining texture and so the cool thing about this trick is it's it working it is working on blending mode so if I turn the blending mode on normal I cannot see nothing but if I put it on screen mode I cannot see the black parts of my image let me zoom you can see see and multiply is the opposite of the screen mode so if I select multiply I cannot see the white parts and all we are left with some beautiful black lines this way you can apply your sketch on any surface with just putting it on multiply mode and also I'm telling this because this trick is little tricky I mean for a second what if you have some image like this it is already white what you're gonna do let me repeat all the steps on this image also Press Ctrl J, press Ctrl Shift U to duplicate uh, to black and white it. Now again press Ctrl J to duplicate it. 
now press control i to invert the value put it on a again color dodge see this time it's not totally white it happens sometimes don't worry about that go to filter blur and gaussian blur it is looking good but anyone can say that it's some software made thing so hit ok now again press ctrl alt shift e and cr create a new layer go back to your this account where it is oh, my computer is really slow go to your texture press ctrl a press ctrl c and press ctrl v and shut off this sketch layer for a moment and this all three also press ctrl t rotate it and make it big enough to fill the background hit enter now turn on your sketch layer go to multi uh, go to your blending options and select multiply again and it's looking far better than we had previously just look at the difference and also if you want color version of your sketch it's really easy to do just select your original layer press uh, ctrl a ctrl c create a new layer paste it and in the blending options select color and lower down opacity a bit and it creates something color version of your sketch so just look at what we had previously I mean really this looks terrible but when we applied some paper texture and some colorizing it looks awesome and believe me it, it will work really better compared to default Photoshop filter galleries sketch options I mean seriously they are terrible this trick works better thanks for watching and if you want some of my future updates subscribe to my channel and blah 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 like blah 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 comment and okay and really thanks for watching just don't follow like stupid just use your mind and be creative thank you thank you for watching